Hey friends, Melissa here uh, with another pop-up episode, we'll call it, of Ask Melissa Anything. I just got a, a message from a former client in the last week that says, do I have any recommendations about a pillow? She's previously had neck pain and it woke her up on the other side the other week and had to sleep in her recliner and isn't feeling good. Posted her question in the, um, in the post. And I said, yes, I do have a recommendation. Here's my recommendation. And of course, I'm telling you <laughs> from my bedroom <laughs> on my bed. All right. So I have had a history of severe neck pain as well. Um, severe bulging disc that pretty much incapacitated me for a couple years. So I am speaking from experience here. And this was in, oh goodness, uh, this is six years ago now, 2013. And so I was recommended to get a cervical roll. So this is what it is. It's a McKenzie cervical roll, all right? Um, if you don't want to buy one, they're about 20 bucks on Amazon. If you don't want to buy one, you take a uh, bath towel and you roll it up, okay? But this is nice because if you look at it, all right, now this is going to be funny because I didn't think about what I was going to do with one hand, is you take your pillow, okay? And what I'm going to do here <laughs> is I'm going to try to one hand this as you take your cervical roll, all right, here's my pillow, and I am going to put it into my pillowcase, all right? So what it does is it slides right in, okay? And I slide it all the way around. And like I said, I have been sleeping with this cervical roll for more than six years. And I actually got a brand new one this last year because my old one really was getting pretty worn. And of course we went somewhere on vacation and it got left in a pillow, which was so sad. But again, it's only 20 bucks. So here's what it looks like. You can't really even tell from a side view. See, it's kind of sticking out there. So watch folks, right? Cause this is, this is why we're, uh, we're doing this. So you can see. So when I go to lay down at night, that roller, I don't know if you can tell, right? This is such fancy footage. It's right here. So I stick it right there in my neck and then my head rests over it so I can sleep with it it's tucked in there or when I'm on my back it's right underneath my neck okay now the challenge is what pillow do you use with it um you don't want something too thin or too thick all right and most of the time if you've had a history of a bulging disc or neck pain what will get you in trouble is too many pillows Flexion forward, very bad, because it can cause, if you're having symptoms down your neck, you guys, that's a disc. If you're having symptoms, um, if you're having symptoms down your arm, that's a disc. And so what this does, if I don't, I don't even dare not sleep with my cervical roll at night because it really supports me. Here's the problem or the thing that I've had to give up. I can't sleep on my stomach anymore and I miss it so bad. I love to lay on my tummy when I sleep. I just can't because it's too much torque on my neck and because of that history. So again, all it is is a roll. It's just, it sneaks inside there and then you adjust its position. Okay. So I just scoot that right down to the bottom of the pillowcase and I kind of have to play around with it because I will tell you, this is one thing that can happen is if for some reason, and I'll pull it back out of my pillowcase here. If for some reason, instead of being here on my neck, um, or back here in the low part, it ends up higher, like at the base of my skull, I will have a horrible headache in the morning. However, if like the other week I was kind of having not a great neck and I don't know if I sat too much or whatever, but if I just go lay down in my bed and I put this underneath it, it just takes all that pressure off. Um, which is why sometimes taking, if you, if you're having that trouble, take a bath towel or, or a towel and roll it up and lay it right across there. Okay, this is where you want it to be. Underneath the base of your skull, okay, between the top of your shoulders and the base of your neck. So, my recommendation, and thanks again for the question, is I highly rec um, recommend a McKenzie cervical roll. If you're having, and based on what I know about this individual, I think this is a good bet and worth trying. Um, it might be something worth trying for you. So again, if you have any questions for Melissa, feel free to send them in a message. We'll be happy to answer them to you directly, or maybe it will end up in a video here for you as well. Because remember, no matter what it is, when it comes to musculoskeletal pain, head, neck, back, knee, pelvic floor, feet, we believe that pain is not normal.